good day subscribers, good day Roxdale fans as ever, good day to anyone new that finds themselves watching this morning. Obviously you've seen from the introduction, it's now been 476 days since the last time we went to a, <clears throat> sorry, last time we went to a football match. Now, disclaimer, I'm doing this opening clip the day after the event. So it's now nine o'clock in the morning, uh, King Cross Station, pint for breakfast before the train home. But I did an opening clip yesterday and it went wrong. That video won't work, but the rest of the vlog does work. So here you go, while I'm a shivering, hungover mess the day after, Here's the vlog for Inter Malaga at the Euros, everyone. Up the Dale. So, it's match day, everyone. As you can see, I'm absolutely shattered. I don't know whose idea it was to set off at 9 o'clock train for a game that don't kick off for another 11, 12 hours. 8 o'clock kick off tonight. Fucking hell, it's going to be a long day. Um, Beer-wise, I'm going to try and fight the urge as long as possible. Because as I've just said, it's pretty much 12 hours till kickoff. So if I start anytime soon, or have one with breakfast, that's going to be a 10 hour beer sesh day. You remember Southend, you remember Plymouth away. I can't end up at Wembley like that because they will not let me in. So I'm going to try and f hold it out until the train in Manchester at 12 o'clock to London, Houston. However, just in case I fail, I do have the bag ready full of these. Let's go and meet the girls at the train station. Good morning ladies. Good morning. Good morning, Good morning Matthew. Good morning. How are we all feeling this morning? Tired. Tired? Yeah. Alright. When we when starting drinking Gary? Um, it's a train day now, it's official. It's we're on, day, we're on, right, the we're on the train. I reckon about 10, 15 minutes so <laughs> when, we, when we get into Manchester we start. Are we, it's coming home. <laughs> <laughs> are we having one with Brecky? Yeah. Not to, it? Is, it'd be rude not to. Yeah. A good 11 hours before kickoff, we yeah. start. Yeah. Right, we'll have that. Go on. Prediction: Italy three, Austria nil. You've gone the same as me. Yeah. That's that's what I've gone for as well. Yeah. I'm gonna say two nil. Two nil. Who two? Italy. Right. Okay. Yeah. We'll see what Will says in a bit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Let's get on. Gary, this is my quick quick chance to get Will in at the moment. Meet Will, everyone. This is Will. This is Will Maxwell, Rochdale's famous Will Maxwell. And look what he's having for his breakfast. Well, what drink he's having? Sorry, guys. Coca-Cola, Will. Yeah, Ronaldo won't be happy. <laughs> oh, is it Pepsi? Yeah, he's happy with Pepsi. I think he does. But what, what are we getting, Gary? Beer. We're getting beer. Matty yeah. Whitworth. He's on Desperado. He's gone for the strongest thing. Yeah. All right. Shame on that man. It was, a bit, it was a bit of a palaver getting it. Ordering all this fucking apps and downloading all this crap. What a... I'm very old and I shouldn't be doing these things. Yeah. Get the breakfast. Well, dis disappointed. That's the uh, breakfast and the beer done, everyone. You have to come that way, Gary. Which way going? I don't know. I'm all trying to order a bag as well. Bre breakfast done. We'll have, a, we'll have a Coca Cola, but now we've had a few pints. I've had a few pints as well. Mask, friends, look at this. No mask. <laughs> no way. Train time and let's get it going, eh? Properly, Will. Proper away. Yeah. We have a Rochdale How mask on. Let's have a look at this. Got to represent, aren't you? Representing the Dale. Come on. Still 25 minutes before this sets off. The beers on the train have just been off. We're not sat off yet, but. Gary is godfather to a professional footballer called Ben Whiteman, played for Doncaster, now it were. Preston, Preston. tell the story. We, um, we, we, we had a game at Scotland this season um, where we, we needed football boots, obviously, us amateurs playing there. So I borrowed several pairs of boots from Ben by his mum. We just had a <laughs> phone call where... Ben is looking for a pair of orange boots, the ones I wore at, 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 at Scotland. Right? He scored a goal and a penalty at Charlton in the playoff semi-final in these, so he really needs them back, so that, now there's a big panic to find these boots. So, Thank you. At Gary's house, and um, I hope they find them, because he's not going to be fucking impressed if he realises, number one, Gary's been playing on them at Scotland. Number two, they want a, a good memento for him. Number three, are they going to find them? Yeah. <laughs> They're well on eBay, aren't they? That wasn't convincing, was it? That wasn't convincing. 
Gary has got um, he thinks it's a fact I'm not sure if it is Simon and Colin definitely know they did a skydive with Jack the Kitman and Gary believes he was naked I believe this is true yeah. did Jack is the it Kitman, true? did Jack the Kitman ever do a naked skydive did, like, did he did he this is like Wood Eye Line to you why are you still got your fucking mask on because I'm yeah, still, he's still citizen. wearing the mask even though we've just been coughing on him citizen. Law abiding citizen He's not. You don't want that four thousand six hundred pound fine. Are we having the Inter Malaga cheers? Because we've not had one yet. Inter Malaga. Inter Malaga. We're in a tunnel. We're nearly in London, and then we really get it underway. If you want, if you want in the Inter Malaga crew, we're under a tunnel, so it's dark, everyone. Matt has got to finish his beer be before we get off in Euston Station now. Do you want in or not? Come on, hang on, get come on. Drunk. Get it drunk. Get it drunk. Look at them bubbles. Come on. That's, like, that's like one of Simon's lager. magical pints from back in the day. There's more in that bottle than when it started. Glug, 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 glug. And he's still not in into a lager. <laughs> <laughs> well done, Matt. That was fair enough, that. So we just got off in Euston Station. Look at, look at this, Retrobates. This is what you get when you come to London. Dickheads like this upstairs. <laughs> Cigarette upstairs. Will, it's a one way system. It's a one way system. But when there's only one way in or out. Yeah. Or out. Yeah. If I want to up in the nicest way, but I, don't want to, I still don't know somewhere I've to go. I don't know what. We just went down the stairs, right? You two have had a good time together in bugs, you know. There's, where's the cord? Oh, Gary's took it. So, so you've got to get a cord to get into the toilet. Yeah. Surely that's against human rights. It's, it's like borderline escape room. Like, there's a escape room. Escape less room. Like, it, I love escape room. There's escape room with less cords than escape room the toilet. There's definitely an escape room because Gary's down there. Down there. Gary, Gary is pissed. pissed. I think Gary's um, he's getting there, Will. He's getting there. It, there's still five hours till kickoff. Five hours till kickoff. And he's pissed as a fan. Will he last? Well, I last. Then start the session. Then start the session. Come on. You've tapped in, you've tapped out, and now we're going underground. I'm going underground. So yeah, we're, to be honest, there's five hours till kickoff, and we're actually quite quite pi that, quite pissed to be fair. I think so. Yeah, we're pissed. We're going to hotel now, Matty. And uh, now we're all pissed. We've got another five hours to get even more pissed. Drop these bags off and get absolutely leathered. I'm not even going to watch this game. I'm going to be fucked. Oh, way rough. <laughs> so we've got to our hotel room, and it, me and Gary are staying in the room with the double bed. <laughs> How the fuck are we, me and you, going to stay on this tonight without? I'd, some are going wrong, you know what I mean? Yeah. I'm already getting naked, everyone, but there's there's ulterior motives for getting naked. It's because it's fucking boiling and I'm putting my shorts and t shirt on. I'm wearing my sunglasses just in case you recognise me. Yeah. <laughs> what have they done to us? Well, we're walking towards King's Cross. Right. You're starving to death. I'm literally like Rashford hungry. Yep. Yeah. I've just showed you the, the hotel room that me and Gary are staying in. There is two beds, but they were tied together. Mm -hmm. So I've had to throw everything out of there. You there. didn't have you didn't have that. No, we just Such... pushed the beds aside. Oh, you yeah. they had, they had a good time. Gary looks really pissed now. <laughs> I'm I'm not lying, am I? No. No, he's struggling. But we're gonna get it back on track. We're gonna go for a McDonald's. Yeah. Some food and a drink. And then get on with it. So it's just gone past four. Kick off at eight obviously. We've got to be in by half five to six o'clock. We're gonna get a quick for all McDonald's dinners, which isn't nutritious, but it fills a void, doesn't it? It's doing the job, isn't it? And then we're going to get another pint and then get the subway, underground, subway. whatever it's called. I don't know what it's called, it's all bollocks, isn't it? Over to Wembley. Let's see what happens, see if Gary can get in. <laughs> Heavenly place, can I get a score prediction from you, speaking to the people of London today for Italy and Austria's game tonight? Score prediction. I, I can't predict the score. I, I'm here to praise the gospel. What? This is not my job. 
Just rest my phone, that's it. Good faith to both teams then? Good fortune? I wish. Okay? Good results for four so, That will do. Too, too scared, you see. Scared of God predicting anything. It's going to be 3 0. It's going to be 3 0. He won't do nothing. Fucking hell. Even our own loudspeaker then as well. Fucking hell. There we go, Will. We're finally out at Wembley Stadium. Ready to enter Wembley Way. Now we're ready to go and try and find somewhere where we can have a fucking drink. Because we've left it too long going into McDonald's. Too long on the train. And now it's time for beer, isn't it? Is it, Gary? <laughs> And you, you don't even know what planet you're on. No, you, you, you're Scala! walking around like, like in a dream world. Hey, you. So here we go, Wembley. Way. Let's get, let's get some beers. Let's get some beers. We, this guy runs it, right? Hey, Austria, from Austria right. as well. Fuck this, Austrian, Austrian fan. Austrian. How you doing, boys? Not bad. Not safe, bad. Safe journey to England. Oh, you live here, right? You live here already. Uh, what score tonight, boys? Well, I'll, I'll take care to one Austria. Two one uh, Austria? Yeah, not, not to embarrass, we'll be alright. Yeah, I think. Dom, and as well? I'll say a 1 1 and then penalty, we win it. 1 1, it's going to be a long night oh, if that yeah. happens, but <laughs> we'll see you now. Good to meet you guys. Yeah, yeah. Thank well, you very much, guys. So that's the Austrians one. Everyone thinks they're going to win, don't they? But they're not going to win, I don't think, somehow. Arts behind us. We've got to finish these first because we can't go any further until we do. <sighs> Feeling pissed now. Yeah, but we do a lot. We're, we're from Manchester. Yeah, Manchester. From Manchester. So, yeah. tonight, Austrian fans, obviously, what score is it going to be? 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, uh, one. Then extra time and 3-4 for Austria. On Plans. penalties? Yeah. A long, a long night for penalties as yeah. well? Yeah, absolutely. So, we met some other Austrian fans down there. They said penalties as well. Well, there we, we go. go. <laughs> well, fingers crossed for you. Finger, fingers crossed. Take care. Have a good evening. That's more. Gary, Gary wants the vlog to begin again because we're in a, a lift at Wembley. I think that felt like we're going down as well. We're meant to be going up to club at Wembley level. We're actually going down. It says down. Let's see who's coming in. No one's coming no, in. Get back in. Get back in. Get back in. Yeah. yeah. Beat two. That's where we want to be. Club Wembley reception. See, what a bloody palaver. Just let us in the fucking stadium. Yeah. I'm ripping. I can't rip this off because they're going to have a go at me again. We, we've, we've managed tickets where all the I UEFA VIPs are coming yeah, from. Yeah. Mate, this going is going stunning. Hey, what yes. happened? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Go back <laughs> down, right? There's fucking birds and all sorts. <laughs> 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 I'm birds not watching this bit. <laughs> Don't worry, we're at Club Wembley level. Me, 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 right, I better go, put this on back on before they win, Right, we need to talk to these people here, right? Here we go. You, you, oh, now we're talking, Gary. Right. That's the Wembley. Look at these seats, man. Absolutely perfect. Just behind um, um scoreboard here. Yeah? Who's, who's he? Who's he? No, to your left. I don't know. Italian media probably, I don't know. What a fucking seat we've got here. Look at this. Inter Malaga has turned up at the home of football. Come on. Fun time, fun time. I'll revert it. Yeah. Go. So we're not watching Rockstar today, but we are watching Rockstar play. Are we? Yeah. Go on. Well, I've seen loads of Rockstar cyclists through a mobile <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> mobile no! But why are you having that? <laughs> I am having that because <laughs> I'm only having right. I'm only having that one because I think I have had it myself before. Not, not on the intro. Not, no. So you can't quite have it. Yeah, no, I can't. He's in there. He's, in, he's immobile. Uh, can't, can't move and he's going to score three goals tonight. Plus, obviously, our uh, favourite player for Austria is Schlager. Into, into my Schlager. Get it down, you then, Gary. One bomb it. Oh, I've got, I dare I've you. Fucking one bomb it. Into the Schlager. Uh, Gary, we're going into a thing now. It's not, it's not, it's not the same match day atmosphere as you've ever been used to before in your life. It's stunning, actually. And it's, it's not for me sterile. either. It's very sterile. It's very weird. And here we are on the concourse. We don't know what to say about it, to be honest. And we don't know what's going on, do we? Yeah. Because we, we've got no fucking songs to sing. Two hours before a match. Two hours before kickoff. Yo, you fucking stink. Sorry, it's wrong. He's shit himself. Right, no, we're on. We, we found. Fritzel. Joseph. 
Fritzel number two. <laughs> Fucking Jesus Christ, what's he got that on his back for? It's not even seven o'clock yet, but it's five to seven, and Will Maxwell has got the team lineups. Can you spell them all? Is Pavarotti playing? Oh. Is he not playing? Is Don Corleone playing? He's on the bench. Oh, he's on the bench. Go on, go. Lorenzo, Benucci, and Serbi, don't know how to say his name. Spinazzola, Barella, Jusinho, Ferrati, Immobile, Farmerdale, Saka, and Insignia. Insignia, the small one. For Austria, you've got Batman, Lena, Jagadis. General Overdrive, you ain't seen nothing yet. Interregger. Oliver, Slager. Into my Slager. So, Will, on the back of this, we've not got you in yet for the score prediction. Prediction, I'm going to go 3 1. 3 1. Right. I'm going to let you guess what I went for. 3 0. I went for 3 0. What did Gary go for? 2 0. 3 0. 3 0. Matty went for 2 0. So, there we go. So, we're all going for an Italy win. What? Ask for Oh, bollocks to them. Matty Whitworth's finally come back from the bar after returning without anything for fucking ten minutes. Fucking living the dream. 21 quid. <laughs> Will... Will wants in. Just a bit of information. Information. Do you know, like, when we're frustrated and deal and we're like, oh, fuck's sake, like, the goal continues, do you know what I'm saying, Italian? No, I don't. With the hands... Good yeah, fucking Manancha. man, motherfucker. Manancha. What's it? Manancha. 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 I'll say La Mancha. I'll say La Mancha for Rochdale. Can we do that one? Man, do that. Ma -ma -ma -mancha. La Mancha. Oh, fucking Manancha. Jesus Christ. Seven pounds. Gino on fucking ITV. Seven pounds. Fucking Manancha. Jesus Christ. What do you talk about, Will? I'll fucking whack you, motherfucker. Something like that. Something so, somewhere along the whole <laughs> Gary has now got a proper one, apparently. He's forgot what it is. You do look like a small Dalmani, little... Dalmani, Dalmani, Dalmani. Dalmani? Dalmani. Show me the Dalmani. Dalmani, show me Dalmani. the... Yeah. It only means fucking tomorrow, don't it? <laughs> so, we've now got Mario and Luigi. Mario, there we go. What's going to be the score tonight? We're never going to see them. We don't see it. Italians never say. Italians never say. Italians never say. Fair enough. So if you win one nil, you'll be happy. I'm not going to say. They will be happy with that. Yes, yes. We have a penalty for fucking happy. Italia. If we win one goal, offside. We're happy. Italians never say. Never understand why the people outside never said before. Like that priest dude. Boys, where are you all from? Uh, it's Italy, yeah, baby! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm from Roma! Yeah. No, you're not. No, we're not. Where are you from? <laughs> London, Greenwich. London from Greenwich. Yeah, London as well. Italy, mate. No, you're not. That's a lie. <laughs> what, right, what, what, let's what, have proper what? accent. No, right. we, we want to score. Fucking nothing. <laughs> I don't know. I don't uh, know. Italy, Italy yeah. Can we have a Oi. score prediction? Jorginho to score a hat trick. You heard oh, it here oh, first. Oh, there you go. Oh, oh, go. Oh, oh, get that on the request a bit. I bet it's a good fucking hat trick. Marco Moratti. Score prediction. 1-0 Italy. 1-0. Yeah. Two, 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 three, every, two. Every single fucker's okay, going for Italy. So someone has got to go for Austria. Austria on penalties. Come on, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Have a bit of that, yes. Come on there, boys. So the teams are coming out, obviously, now, as we say. I hope Italy are playing in blue, and I hope Austria are playing in traditional red, blue against red, at Wembley Stadium. Italy, Austria, Will, we're going for it now. What have you got there, pizza? Italy, Will, what can, hang, hang on, hang on. Oh shit, that is. That's not worth Italian pizza, is it? I've had Italian pizza. No. <laughs> it feels good to be at a big, a big game again. I'd rather be at a Rochdale game, to be honest. I really would. But Wembley's got 22,000 people in it. Let's get it underway and I'll now go to the national anthems in a moment. Who's booing it? I 
shouldn't talk for it, but I'm a twat. <laughs> Hi, Gary. I'm still disappointed about that pizza. This is shit. This is My arms are aching everyone, I'm putting it down. It's about to begin. Austria to take the kickoff will. And Inter Malaga's only European game is about to go in there, isn't it? I know, yeah. Let's see. Am I in there? I don't know, I am. Turn this fucking stupid guy singing off. Let's get kickoff underway. There we go, we're underway. We are underway in the last 16, Italy, Austria. Let's see what the game bit. Um, let's see what happens. Very early, they pretty much first attack of the game. The Italians are going for. Ah, oh, they're out, they're out. Yeah, they're going to put it back in midfield. It's going to be a lot more cagey than a Rochdale game because they're not going to make that many mistakes, people. The Italians are going to dominate this game by the look of it. A nice, a nice little turn on the edge. Oh, he's got. Oh, he was, he was too immobile again. He was too immobile, Will. That's how I said he'd play for Dale. 300 appearances for Dale. To be fair, so far, Austria are holding their own here. They're holding their own. Holding their own. I can't wait because I'm, I'm sat around a lot of um, Italians. All oh, the Italians are coming forward. Italy are coming forward. Oh, he's gone wide. He should have had it middle. We're on nine minutes, Austria took it off him, like taking candy off a baby that way. Taking my cap off, it's doing me anything. It's got, it might be a long game. Italy are going forward, I've been told off a spawn last year. It's the first shot on target. It was okay then, the, then the left wing and everything, but uh, the right wing, sorry. But yeah, I've been told off for supporting Austria now. So that makes me want to support Austria even more. Um, well, was that the best chance of the game? Easily the best chance of life. Easily been absolutely dominated. Like. Well, we, on, we can see, we can actually see yeah. the scoreboard behind us as well, in a way. 20 minutes in. 20 minutes in. There's a ball over the top and Austria had a one on one, I'm not sure. Was it? I, I would have know. scored that on, I would have scored that on Sharkov pitch, no danger. I can't turn it round. The Italians are coming forward again. Now, they're not, they're not going to hit it in. No chance. But that was a good chance. Yeah, really good chance. And he's put this forward now, it's going to be a long <laughs> ass time that you're watching. I'm going to say, I'll get it in a minute, I'll cut this one out. 
Will told us the Italy striker played for Dale. He's immobile. He's immobile. Yeah. He did look right though, didn't he? He did look right. He never got that score. He played thousands of years for Dale. We're on for the first corner of the game. The sun's shining through, shining on me, obviously, no one else. Let's see the first corner of the game go in. Oh, it's a decent one. Oh, it's an header away. Austria, they are defending. They are defending. Is it going to come back in? Put it back in. Yeah, international football is very different to club football, Will. Very different. They won't put it back in unless he's going to. No, he's not going to. You're boring me. He's wide here. Oh, fuck this. I'm not sure where I think it is in you. I can see I'm trying to get the camera out. I'm looking at the replay now, which is behind us as well. Is it? Is it the joint and the crossbar? I think. Yeah, he has. Is it a joint and the crossbar? It's out wide. Still nil nil. It was always going wide. And now it's time for Austria to go back forward. Back forward, is that? Don't know. There we go. Closest chance of the game so far. Half an hour in. Are they going to grab one just before half time? I'm going for a pint in a minute or a piss. There might be a goal if I go for a piss. Oh. Come on, Austria. Come on, Austria. Offside? He should have... Why is he not flagging that? Miles of time. A goal. Crazy. The last clip of the first half. Italy have got one on the edge of the... Ed, kind of the edge of the box, as you can see. Don't know. Austria got a high line. High line. I won't move that high line. They've defended well. He's moving already. No, no, no. Ah, he's headed it wide and that's it. Nil-nil half-time everyone, let's get the half-time analysis, another pint! Austria played alright actually, they've, they've held their own. So it's half-time, who's your favourite Mortal Kombat character? Oh, it's Italy nil, Austria nil for the Inter Malaga tour at Wembley. Will half time analysis. From a long way out. They're taking too much of the ball. He said, he said, I think Italy, what they should be doing is playing it wide a bit more. Didn't take it. Didn't take it. Because they're no good, are they, Matty? Austria are going to take this. No, Italy are no good. They're thinking too much on the ball, and Austria have counter-attacked in a way. They've not been too bad. I don't think they've been. I don't think they've been too bad. No. I'm the only one cheering for Austria up there, and they're all having a look at me. I've seen Rio. Yeah. I've, I've seen. Him. And you're in Switzerland. And and Tira, they're all they're all up there next to us, aren't they? So the second half, what we're going to do is, we're going to try and make them all sing for the vlog. Are we? Yeah. Are we singing? We went for the, up the day or the road if just, we just sing the names because they won't listen to anything else, will they? Bastards! <laughs> Bastards! So now we're out after... I don't know what's happened. They're all the edge of the box, Gary. I don't know what's happened, but it's happened. But it's happened, yeah. So now we're out for the second half, everyone. Up there. And we'll see what's happened there. Eh? You've got pizza in your fucking thing. We'll see. So, just coming out after half time. Uh, it's 50 minutes, so obviously, like my Rockstar vlogs, we're, fi we're five minutes late. But Austria have a free kick right on the edge of the box. Literally right on the edge of the box. I'm talking close. This is going in. This is going in. Come on, come on, come on boys, come on. Is it going in? I don't know. Oh my god! That was close, that was close, that's the closest fucking attempt at the game. They weren't in Italy, are not going to let that happen again. Jesus. 
see, see, all all the atmosphere will there. Uh, I was waiting, I was waiting for Italy to put it in at the side. They've not put it in. Austria are going to get this. They're going to take this for extra time. We're going to do it. We got, we got the cameras there up there with whoever's in the BBC Sports um, studio. It's Anthony Taylor. Anthony Taylor's the referee. He was the one at the Denmark game for Ericsson. Is he not? Was he not? No, Michael, Michael Oliver's got her. Ah! It's over the net. Matty Whitworth have said, do you want some of that? Have you seen how fucking chomped on this pizza's been? There's nothing left of it and you're telling me, do you want it? Do I fuck want any of that shit? You stupid twat. Oh, and Italy is still going forward. So I've run, we're in the 60th minute. It's still nil-nil. You know what? This might go to extra time, everyone, because Austria are looking pretty solid in defence, and Italy are struggling to break them down. Not like they brought Turkey down and brought Switzerland down. Maybe there's the next level to go for it, but we'll, we'll soon find out. We'll soon find out. There's a lot of Leeds fans behind us. That are absolute gobshites, and I hope I can, I can see him on the gobshites. Sit down, Leeds fans. Closest one for Austria again, the deflected shot straight over the post. Now it's a corner kick. <laughs> yes! yes! Austria 1 0 up. I told you I was sporting Austria. The 1 0 up. They've, they've silenced the Italians. It's 1 0. The, the ball was going in. And there's the scoreboard! Yeah, we should have Yes! Come on then! Everyone's really angry around me because everyone wants Italy to win. And I told you at the start of the video. Austria win! Austria win! There's a beer here, check, as you can see behind me. I'll see that way at Wembley. If there's a beer here, check, it's being overruled, isn't it? Austria team were offside, weren't they? Controlled the ball with his arm. Is that what they're saying? With his arm? What are they saying? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. That, that says goal for uh, the Austrian player. In the last time I came to Wembley Stadium, there were VAR controversy, Will. Oh, he's turned it over. Oh, no, it's nil nil. It's still nil nil. Controversy happens. Controversy has happened. They're all turning at me now, laughing at me. So I'm celebrating. What a game! We need content of where they sit. Oh, the, the, this statue it. plays for. Who's he play for? What, Immobile, eh? Mm. He's played for Rockstar thousands of times. I know. We're going to get a live ball here. Oh! Oh! No, it's over the bar. It's over the bar. Go on, Will. It's like a bit to Italy a couple of times at my end. And he gets more northern in Italy than he does when he's here. Who does Matty? Yeah. So like we'd be like going by in summer and he'd be like, Cho. Cho. <laughs> Pronounce his shit. Yeah, Cho. <laughs> but also for Finney, if he's watching, which I'm sure he will. Finney, be. we need to talk about Finney. And Finney, if you're watching, I hope you're okay over in. Is he still in Russia? Poland. Poland now. Oh, yeah. I don't know what. I don't know. It's, it's, like, it's hard to keep up. I'm going to do Finney proud here. And this is like a phrase like, thank you, I borrowed your charger or something. And it's, <laughs> to me, I salvaccio la vita. And Whitworth had to say it to some girl on the uh, train. Yep. And, um, like, uh, and, and he said it like, to me, I salvaccio la vita. And I just said it like Italian. And it might be going on a bit now, but are, are Austria are going to get this for extra time. <laughs> They're going to do them. I'm fucking telling you, they might take this extra time. They They've got a free kick in the middle of the middle of the park. Italy just haven't made the most of what they can do. Like they've the, really not. They should uh, they should have steamrolled it in the first the half. Wide, like we and after, after the goal got disallowed, Italy should have really gone. We're not having any of this. Yeah. Well, they haven't. So it's that lack of the world class striker. Like I know we joked about Immobile, but they don't have a world class striker. So. And we'll see. I'll we're now into the last 10 minutes, everyone. It's difficult to, like I just said to Will then, it's really difficult to judge who you want to support, in a way. It's not, it's not Rochdale for me, so it's, it's hard. It's like, 
We just want a goal now. We've already had one that got this life of VAR. We celebrated it. Go on, go on, go on! Oh! Corner ball, corner ball to Austria. Come on! Austria have had the better chances. They have, they have. And they will, well, what's the corner ball in? What minute are we on? 80th minute. Let's see. And the resulting corner. Oh, it's, no. I don't like short ones. Because that's what they go wrong, short ones. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Come on, Austria, come on. Oh, is it the, is it the fucking thing there? We're in the 88th minute. I think Italy are going to find... Are they going to find one before it goes to extra time? Yeah, I want it to go to extra time. It's got to go to extra time. Oh, no. Oh! oh keeper's ball. Come on. Come on, Austria. It's going, it's going to extra time, Will. No, not got it. This could be a long night. <laughs> I want extra time. This could be a very long night. What's he done? Hamstring, he's down on floor. Italy have got to kick it out unless the pumps. They won't do though. They will do after it. Five minutes of injury time at the end of the game will. We've got the same feeling something's going to happen at the end of the game before it goes to extra time. Sort of oh, he's in, he's in, he's in. He's not offside. Get up, you fucking little puff. He's offside, he's offside. This is going all the way, this. It's going all the way to penalties. Help. Right, everyone, it's the final minute of injury time. We thought we were in the box, but it's not. Italy have got one on the edge of the box. It's even, it's even. Where are they cheering from? The upper tier? I can't, I can't see them. But well, we're gonna we're gonna find out now. I can hear, you, but I can't see you. I'm hoping this does not go in because I want the 30 minutes of added time. We're soon gonna find out. I'm not zooming in any further. Oh, it's good. It's a good header. That. It's a good header. It's away. It's away. It's a good header. That good. Good defensive header. That. Do I apologise if it's going to be a long vlog, but they've stopped the bar, haven't they? Yeah. Now we've got to go out for the first time of extra time yeah. without a beer in us. Forever. We've just had to have a piss and go back out to see Austria win this game. I'm sleeping with this man tonight. <laughs> <laughs> the dirty bastard! The Italians have just scored it. <laughs> I didn't want him to, I didn't want him to. Like Insignia, he came into the edge of the box, came into him, he just slammed it into the bottom corner in the first stage of extra time. Done. It was a good goal, it looked like a good finish, but Austria have got to go for it now, I don't know. Get the VAR out right again and fuck him off, please. So I wanted Austria to go through, but there we go, neat finish. Let's see. One nil Italy, extra time. They're gonna t oh no, yeah, they're gonna take it. It's free kick, it's another yellow card. It's nearly half time in extra time. Austria not getting out of this alive. It's gonna end up being an Italy win everyone. Okay, I know it's long everyone. But let's see. Let's see. It'll be half time in extra time after this kick. Sorry everyone, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at the roof, aren't I? Oh, what a save! Great save! Great save! That'll be it, he's gonna blow, he's gonna blow already. Good save. They've got it, the cheeky bastards, just, be talk, just before the half time interval in extra time. First to say it's full time now, Will. Italy approved. Bunch of little fucking mafia wankers. We're flagging video wise now. I know it's been a long night, everyone. I hope you're still watching. Austria's still coming forward. They had a decent effort, didn't they, Will? It, it, it was down the side. It was a good strike, but 
Italy have done a job, but they should have done the job in 90 minutes. I'm not worried about this if we come across them in the final. No, the groups, they were much better in the groups, well. Much better. Go on, he's, he's dropped it. Fuck off. Get the fuck out of here. Why are keepers so protected? Bullshit. Austria are not getting a better chance than that again. That's it. The, the, there's 10 minutes to go. He was in the box on his own. They're not getting another chance like that, Will. They're not. They're not. Old school spoon. Yeah. They fucked, he fucked it. He spooned it. It was like George Donnelly, wasn't it? It is game over. It's 2 0. Game over. No more clips unless a goal happens. We'll see us on the way out. Austria have just scored. They've got five minutes to save this game, Will. They're going to VAR it probably, but that looked like a legitimate goal to me. Get in, come on! They're in, they're in, they're in. Woo! Still time, still time for penalties. Come on, boys. It's the, it's the final minute of the game. Austria are trying to go for it, but they're not going to get one. It's 2-1. Is, is it blew the whistle? Is it over? Or is, what's he done? One minute. Oh. Bastard. So it now is full time from Wembley. Probably after, as soon as I cut this, it's probably the longest vlog in the world. Italy were the better team. Austria fought. It went all the way to 120 minutes. Shame it didn't go to penalties. And here we are at Wembley and now we're about to leave. I thought it was all right game when it came down to the nitty gritty then. The uh, extra time was actually a good run. Yeah, there were, well there were goals in extra time Will. <laughs> That's all we wanted, we got it. So it's goodbye from Wembley. In a moment. So yeah, it's done. Italy are through to the last 16. I don't know about next season everyone. Hopefully, e well I don't know even about Tuesday. Hopefully England get the fucking Revenge against the Germans on Tuesday. We'll find out about that. That'll be fun. Next season, Roxdale. If we're allowed away days, we're having it. If we're not, I might see you another time. But here we are from Wembley. Will. From Wembley. Yeah. Good Thanks night from Wembley. <laughs> whoa, 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 Gary, good whoa, night whoa. from Wembley. Good night, Wembley. Matty. You look perfect. You've been touching me all night, you chat. Good night from Wembley. Good night. Done. Italy 2, Austria 1, extra time. I'll see you now at the proper bread and butter, Roxdale. Good night.